Hey guys, welcome to my channel Code Canvas. In this video, we will create a JavaScript function that will return indexes of two numbers such that they add up to target. So there is one website leadcode.com where you can find number of problems in different languages. So we are looking into one problem and creating the JavaScript function here. Okay. So what will be the problem? We have one array nums and the values of this array is 2, 7, 11, 15. The target value is 9. So the expected output here is 0, 1. Why? Because 2 plus 7 is equal to target value 9 and 2 is at index 0 and 7 is at index 1. So expected output is 1. Right. So we need to create such function here. Okay. Let's start creating the function. Let me open the JavaScript. Okay. So uh, let me copy the num variables arrays so we can use. Okay. Let and simply log with function. Okay. Do sum of nums and the second argument is target. Okay. So let's start creating the function. Okay. So first of all, we need to look through this array. For that, we need to create a for loop for i is equal to 0, i less than nums dot length i plus plus. So it will look through all the num array, nums array. Okay. Let's console so you can get better idea. You can see it is looping through the array elements. Okay. So uh, it is in loop. So you can see it is four times. Okay. We will fix this. So after this, we will need another loop. Why? Because we need to compare this sum with the target. So for that, what we will do? We will create another loop. Let j another variable and where this j starts. It starts from i plus 1 because we already have taken 0th element and for the second loop we need second element. Right. So for that we need to use j is equal to i plus 1. j less than nums dot length that is same and j plus plus. Okay. Now we can see. So we have now two loops, okay. One with i is equal to zero, it will loop through all array elements, and second is j is equal to i plus one, that will start from seven, eleven, and fifteen, okay. So in that loop, we can write down our logic. So what will be our logic? If nums of i plus nums of j equal to target. So what is our target? 9 in this case. If nums of i plus nums of j is equal to target then we can simply return array right and in array we can return nums of i comma nums of j and let's see what it returns it is returning 2 and 7 because we have array and target is 9 right so how this loop will work first of all it will add 2 plus 7 2 plus 11 2 plus 15 7 plus 11 7 plus 15 and last 11 plus 15 okay and in this loop if this condition satisfies. In this case, it will satisfy with 2 and 7. Okay. Let's change this target. Uh, let's make it 26. Okay. 15 plus 11. And let's see what it returns. It is returning 11 and 15. These two elements. Right. So, we will come to it later. So, now the target value is 9. So, it is returning 
2 and 7 but we don't want values we want indices indexes right okay in that case we can remove nums of i and nums of j and simply return i comma j and it will return 0 1 and that is our expected output okay so we can change the target value is 26 for example and you can see the index value is 2 and 3 that is 0 1 2 that is 11 and 3 is 15 so that is fine let's check out another value another array so we can see if that test case is also satisfied okay 6 and it is returning 1 2 that is expected output okay so let's copy this function and run here so we can see if it is running successfully let me remove this console and run the code yep it is correct right so you can see output is 0 1 that is expected here okay so there are few test cases you can change the value here like this and run again solution either does not exist or not unique yeah because this is not expected output this is the target value yeah it was my bad yeah so this is correct one two that is expected output so this was a very easy example but yeah sometimes you need to think how you can use this using javascript so there is alternate solution to this function you can create while loops but again you need to create two loops so for loop is fine in my opinion all right okay guys that's all for this video if you find this video useful please subscribe to my channel give me a like and if you have any better solution you can leave your comments in that below section thank you guys